how to properly vent sex a uh, day old chick and wing sex a day old chick. I had a lot of questions on the group, so we'll take the time and show you the proper way to do it. Now, these little fellas here just hatched last night. easier to show you on a silky of the skin. Now, there's a proper way to hold a chick. What you want to do is you want to grasp between your fingers and your between your ring finger and your pinky the head. You want the head and the neck to be between there. Hold it still. You want to squirt out any excrement that's in there. Take this finger, push up, hold down. That opens the cloakia. Now what you're going to look for here is when you pull up here and that comes to that point you see that little dot that's sticking out That means it's a rooster. Now, see it went out, it went back in. base, that little bump that comes out. That's the male organ. Now, wing sexing is not possible on a bantam. You cannot wing sex a bantam. But, this is a leghorn. A leghorn, you can wing sex. Wing sex, you want to open the wing and you want to look at the white wings here. See the wings, the feathers in between are shorter than the ones on the exterior. So, what you want to look for for a female is a long feather then a short feather just like that long short long short long short now on a male I know this is a male because I already sexed them earlier they're all the same size they're all even if you look there's no short in between. They're all the same length. That's a male. Little penis coming out. Pop right out of there. A little bump. That means it's a little boy. And that concludes vent sexing and wing sexing.